show you guys live mode. Look, the flowers twirl. How cool is that? I love it, and I love that this is like a sheer butterfly as well, and the candle is just so pretty. He's going to play video games. You know what? Uh, no, we'll wait on that. Uh, the second room that we have is like this water slide. It's really cool, and I really like the frog that it just kind of spits out water. <laughs> the last room that we have is uh, like this one that you can attach to the back side of your house, which I thought was cool. But look at this citronella candle. It actually smokes. How cool is that? It's like in real life when they do that. So beautiful, says Ombra. This is gorgeous, says Liam. I know, right? This is a speaker. How cool is that? And it comes in all sorts of really fun, bright colors. This is, oh my gosh, we get three brand, okay. Now I'm just getting ahead of myself because I'm way too excited, but we get three brand new drinks. We get lemonade, citrus swig, and iced tea. <laughs> so I'm excited about that. I feel a little distracted because I'm really bothered that this entire lot just deleted right before our eyes. But oh well. Okay, so we're going to filter this down to packs. Tables with the flowers. Oh, I love this pack. Oh yeah, this pack just gets even more awesome. You followed? Welcome, ghost to the family. I'm so sorry I didn't pop up though. But thank you for following. I appreciate that you're here. It does mean a lot to me. Best frog in the world. <laughs> there it is, ghost. Thank you so much for following. I am so happy that you're here. It's sleeping kitten for you, my friend. Okay, so we get a ton of stuff in this pack. We get these really cute chairs. Um, okay. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to put down every single item that I did before, but I like that we get all of these different options. I'm going to make sure you guys can see the back of the chair, too, because look how cute. And it comes in all sorts of really bright, cute colors. We get, uh, this one's called the Flowery. Uh, there we go. Let's just place this one over here. Um, uh, this one's my favorite one. Kind Sir 18. Thank you so much for following. Welcome to the stream. I'm so happy that you guys are here. Hello to you. So I think it's really cool that uh, we get these bright, fun colors. Or if you're not like a bright, brah kind of person, you get the mellow, the mellow chair. <laughs> so there's options for you as well. We do have a brand new love seat. <laughs> It is so pretty and it's just the neat thing when I was looking at this furniture was how cool would this be like yeah in a backyard but like in a beach home somewhere wouldn't that be awesome oh. <laughs> continuing on we have a table called Millie's dining I thought this was really pretty for your family to kind of I don't know sit out in the back patio have a barbecue with some friends and it comes in all sorts of really fun different colors love the new blue and pink thing going on with the chairs matches my hair that's cool is your hair really pink and blue that's awesome see the girl welcome to the family i'm so happy that you're here thank you for following and i really like that we have this kind of it's not an end table, but it's like a table when you first come into a house where you just throw all your crap, like your like your keys and your purse. I really like this table. And when you guys see the house that uh, we're going to go have a party at later, I put this outside and I put like some clutter on top of it. So I'm excited to show you that. Or even a kid's room. Yeah. And I love this would be cute in a kid's room, this bright end table. But it's just this stuff doesn't have to go on the backyard. Like, yeah, it's called the backyard stuff pack but it, all of this stuff doesn't have to go in the backyard it's pretty enough to go inside your house <gasps> I just realized something those of you that have the movie stuff pack how awesome would this stuff be the bright color stuff mixed in with your house with this stuff <laughs> you're the first person to say my user right name right <laughs> well I am happy that I was able to say that right because I kind of mutilate people's names. I don't mean to. Uh, this one's called a Millie's Coffee. I thought this was a cute, tiny little coffee table, but you know what? This would just be, wouldn't this be beautiful in a beach home? I mean, really, can you just see this <laughs> in a beach home? Okay, we need more room. <laughs> I run out of room, so let's run back over onto this side. We're going to be going back and forth and back and forth. Yes, 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 says Dunfake. <laughs> Okay, so perfectly patterned large umbrella table. Hey, in uh, do you guys ever read the little descriptions that they have for the stuff in uh, Create a Sim in build mode? They're hilarious. There's a uh, 
birdhouse that it's pretty darn funny what it says. Okay, so look how freaking big this is, right? So you can take these chairs, and if I remember right, I think six of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> that little chair is gonna hang out by itself. You can fit six sims around this table. How cool is that? And their plates and everything can fit on here too. I tested it. Uh, Ambera says, especially as frog decal. Oh, I, can I have an idea for the frog decal. I wanna tell you when we get there. But I think these umbrellas are really cool. This one is actually a see-through. So when your sims are sitting, you can kind of see through it right now. So you can see that table in the background. I really like that you can see through this umbrella. I don't know, it's really neat. Drew True says, yeah, I like reading the descriptions on the objects. Yeah, six, six, <laughs> so many chairs, yay. I know, I'm excited. Okay, so this one is called Next Level Perennials. I thought this was so pretty. It comes in all sorts of different colors. My friend and the baby doll just went online. I don't know if that pops up. It probably should. Uh, it, did you see it in the corner? I don't know. Okay, anyways, but the neat thing about this is there's a slot up on top. Uh, let me see. Will let me put this up. Yay! So you can store stuff up there. Can you guys see that? I just put the lemonade thing up there. So you can get even more decorative. You can put all this decorative stuff up there. I was really excited about it. She will Freel says, Where, which Sims 4 game and or stuff pack is your favorite? I don't have a favorite. It's like with children or pets. It's like you don't have a favorite. You love them all equally. <laughs> it just is excitable. I know, right? Okay, so back to the pack. We have these awesome water slides and they are freaking huge and beautiful. <sighs> this brought back so many fun memories of my childhood and playing on the slip and slide. Do you guys know what a slip and slide is? I'm a really old, old lady, so you guys may not know what a slip and slide is. But when I was little, I was like this big. <laughs> there were these water slides. They're bright yellow and they're called slip and slides. And you run and you throw your body on them and you slide all the way across. And when you get to the grass, you kind of end up getting all cut up because the grass really hurts. <laughs> But then the ends turn into mud anyways, so yeah, these, and there's a freaking shark, and then this shark part spits out water out of the teeth, it's amazing. And then you can put soap on this, and your sims are covered in soap, it's just, yeah, slip and slide for days, MCG family is here, so happy to see you. <laughs> they know what I'm talking about. Okay, so we get wind chimes. We get so many different options of wind chimes. We get uh, ceramic, aluminum, bamboo, but I think... My favorite, I don't know, I can't pick a favorite one. It's kind of hard because they all sound so beautiful. But the neat things about the wind chimes is they don't ring constantly. It's just from time to time you hear a little tinkle, tinkle, tinkle in the background. It's really neat. <laughs> so you get that one that hangs up on the side of the building and then you get, will it let me do it? Oh, I did type in the cheat code. And then you have this one where it hangs on a ceiling. These can go inside of your house. So I thought that was kind of neat. It would be really neat to place the bamboo ones like inside of a day spa. Where's the bamboo? Bamboo! Bam! There you go! How pretty is that? And then I'll have to remind- someone remind me when we get back to the house when we throw the party. You can actually change the pitch of the wind chimes and it's really neat because when you change the pitch, the, the length of these rods change. It's just really neat. Oh, <laughs> we would use big black garbage bags because my parents hated us as robotic ducks. I went to camp when I was teeny tiny this big and they attached a bunch of big black garbage bags together and they put it on this big huge hill and they put a Dawn dish soap on it and a hose and it was part of a relay race where they would, <laughs> I can't believe I'm telling you guys this, they would throw us a raw chicken <laughs> and we would have to hold on to it as tight as Shawly wool Wooly. Oh, I think I said your name wrong. I'm so sorry, but welcome to the family. I'm so happy that you're here. So part of the leg of this uh, relay race was that they would throw a, a, a chicken at you and you would have to hold it down. And anyways, it was really fun. So the black garbage bag, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> End of my terrible story. So we get lemonade. Let's put it on these tables over here. We get uh, summer drink trays and they come in all sorts of really fun colors. Um, yeah, I thought the little Gerber Daisy was a fun, beautiful little touch. 
And let's see what else. We have bird feeders. Did you guys watch the live stream of The Sims? If you guys watched the live stream, we learned that there is a one in seven chance of being attacked by birds when you use this. And at the house that I have in the game, I have it all set up. Oh, I hope it doesn't delete it. But I have it all set up. I have seven bird feeders right in a row. We're going to select one of the Sims to be a victim and be attacked by birds. It's really kind of funny. <laughs> I wonder how carrying a raw chicken feels. It's disgusting. And then it was covered with soap, and then you had to go down this huge water slide and try and hold on to it. It was absolutely disgusting, but I remembered it. <laughs> it was a very gross memory of mine, but that's summer camp. <laughs> and then we have the potted plants. It's called potted gumdrop, but what I like about this one is when you go through the different options, the pot colors change, but look at this pretty pink and purple one we get. Can you imagine like an enchanted fairy forest with something like this? <laughs> I mean, if it was me, I would just have it in my backyard because I like those kind of colors in my backyard. But that's, yeah, I thought that was really pretty. More potted plants. These uh, comes in polka dots. And I think if I remember it, right, yeah, they come in solids too. So if you're not like a, a bright person, it's okay to come in solids. No worries. Cooking ramen while I watch you, says C the girl. If you Google dragon noodles, uh, budget bites that is the best ramen recipe I've ever had google it <laughs> it's amazing <laughs> we use ramen noodles for it and it's just amazing so more potted flowers pretty excited comes in different colors uh, comes in polka dots as well I'm so bummed the lot deleted I'm so bummed because I placed every single item um, okay these are wall decals we need to find a wall <laughs> Let's go way over here. Here it is. We'll use this poor little victim. We'll use this wall. Uh, what don't you understand? Oh, <laughs> so the flower decals I think are really pretty. They come in all sorts of different colors. We get frogs as well. Um, and if you guys know the trick where you can use the left bracket or the right bracket, you can make them bigger. Is it going to do it? Oh, it's hard to see around a microphone. Yeah, it's not going to do it because I'm not clicking the right button. But you can enlarge them or you can make them all sorts of different sizes. My grand has a bird feeder in her backyard and that sounds really nice. That um, I'm sure they're not the attacky birds that come in this game. Because <laughs> it's kind of funny when they attack and I feel really bad when I laughed. Uh, we also get waxing perennial. This one's so cool. Okay, so when you check, check on check on when you click on the option for this one see how it changes down there you get all of these different options you get the one with the birds you get one with the uh like flowers so i really like that there's options in this entire pack for really bright stuff and then there's options for kind of cool calm colors <laughs> i probably wouldn't have considered buying this if it wasn't for the live stream says p uh prince hi prince i'm so happy to see you hello <laughs> I know, and this is just build mode. I haven't even gotten to the, the, the gameplay. The gameplay? You're going to freak out. Okay, so <laughs> we have uh, butterflies that come in all sorts of really fun different colors. I like that you can actually see through the wings. That was cool. The birdhouse, decorative birdhouse. Some plum actually sealed the opening to this birdhouse to prevent any birds from getting inside. <laughs> what good is a birdhouse if they can't use it, basically is what it says. So, <laughs> placing it in your yard may raise some few eyebrows from your neighbors. So, that was one of my favorite uh, little descriptions. If you guys click on these things and read the descriptions, that's probably one of my favorite ones out of this pack. And yes, I went into that much detail when they sent this to me. I read all of the items. Isn't that such an adorable little pack? Hi, <laughs> princess, hello. So this is Taste of Tart, Pucker Up Your Buttercup. This is just a decorative item, which I thought was really cute. Those look like lemons inside, if I can, um, I need to get my glasses. Uh, lemons and limes, more decorative items. This is a condiment caddy. Okay, so we were talking about the rugs earlier. So these flower rugs, they match the decals, but look at this. Okay, for the decal, how cool would this be for like an outdoor public swim area? So I thought that was cool. How cool would the frogs be at the bottom of a swimming pool? <laughs> Wouldn't that be fun? Just to place these at the bottom of your pool build. I just thought it would be really fun and I don't know. Oh, you could place this on the walls uh, of the pool. <laughs> You can tell I'm really excited about this. Oh, the rugs. Oh, the rugs are, these are called sun rugs. 
I think I would place these all around my house. I wouldn't just have them in the backyard. Prince, hello again. <laughs> Thank you so much for following. I really appreciate that you're here. That you're here. Um, it comes in all these different colors. Look at the yellow polka dots. How cheerful. Oh my god, that would be so much fun, Rory. It looks so cute. I know. Doesn't it look cute? I mean, that would be snazzy. <laughs> I just, I love these rugs. You can place them all around the house. You can place them in like your kids' room. You can place them anywhere. You can place them out in the back patio. The house that we're going to in the game later on for the party, I just placed it on the back patio, but there's so many different options down here. Oh, the flowers. Look at the flowers. <laughs> so the citronella candles we already saw over here, but this is just what they look like. They come in all sorts of really fun different colors. Tawdry Tawny Trudon. Wow, that was hard to say. That one looks like a ladybug. It does look like a ladybug. And one of these pots, I forgot. I think it was one of these or one of these. It's actually colored like a ladybug as well. So I thought that was really cute. More lighting stuff that you can place outside. And I love how, um, actually, should we go to live mode? We can. Let's push play. Look how it glows. Isn't that so cool? It like dances like a real flame in real life. I don't know. I like the little details like that. I'm easily distracted. I'll just sit there and stare at it and be like, oh, it's like real life. <laughs> okay, so I already showed you guys all of that. I showed you guys that there's more lanterns that you can place around for lights that comes in all sorts of different colors, bright and dark. So if you're not a bright person, don't worry. You have options for dark. Oh my gosh, I got to show you this. Okay, so let's go back over to a wall. <laughs> These flowers, they're called Constellation Lighting. I'm going to have to, uh, it comes in different colors, which I was really excited about. Yay. But look what happens when you change it to nighttime. <gasps> they glow. So not only can you put them outside on your back patio, but how cute would that be in a children's room or a kid's playroom? Or like in a children's room, like right above their bed. I thought that would be so cool. So uh, you guys are liking the idea for the frogs. Wouldn't that be cool to have it at the bottom of a swimming pool? You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, so continuing on, let's turn it back to daytime. There we go. I would love to put those in kid rooms. I know, right? It would be so cute. Oh my gosh, the flowers. These flowers are absolutely amazing. They spin, they light up. And if you watch the live stream when Sim Guru Graham, he put a whole bunch of them in a row, but just kind of offset. They spun in a really neat pattern. That was cool. And when your Sims come over and watch these, they get the dazed moodlet, which I thought was really neat. Okay, so we're going to turn it to nighttime. So I'm going to show you guys that these glow. They're so pretty, but I want to show you guys. <gasps> Isn't this awesome? <laughs> so when I got this pack for early review last week, I just sat here like this and just watched these flowers. They're so beautiful. I know I'm a nerd, you guys, but whatever. You guys, you know, so you can take it, pick it up, make it super big when you use the bracket, and then <laughs> I had so much fun playing with this. And then it's a really big flower. Freak it out, man! <laughs> I mean, how fun is this? All right, end of the stream. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I just really liked the flowers. I thought they were really cool. I just, I'm just, I'm easily amused, but I love the attention to detail in this. So freaking excited. I know, I forgot who it was, but someone mentioned that every time um, that they started a, a drinking game, and every time I said I'm so freaking excited, they were going to take a drink of whatever they had nearby. So yeah, you're going to have to pee in about 10 seconds if that's the truth, because I say that a lot. I get excited about almost everything. Can we? Okay, yes, we can. I want to show you guys what these speakers look like. So let's pull up the walls. So these speakers are called Plumbot Box, and I really like that they come in like a basic white. They come in all of these fun colors as well. So I thought that was kind of neat. So again, you have the options of really bright, loud, fun summer colors, but you get the muted colors as well. I'm way too excited about that giant shadow. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> Next, we have the wild gumdrop bushes, and they come in all of these really fun ombre colors. Saintly Badger, thank you so much for following. Welcome to the family. I really means a lot to me that you're here so thank you very much for clicking the follow button and for being here 
So yeah, this is what the bushes look like, and I think they're so pretty how they do kind of like a gradient into other colors. I was part of that conversation. Unfortunately, I didn't have a drink on me. Yes, you were part of that conversation. I have a, an energy drink near me, so here. I'm so excited! Okay, everybody drink. <laughs> I say that a lot. I just get really excited about things. Feeling froggy fountain. Okay, so this guy comes in a lot of different colors. He comes in his basic green, all of these fun different colors, and you can see the back of him, how he's kind of spreckled. You can have him, like, watering the plant, I guess. I don't know. I'm not very creative when it comes to build mode, so I deeply apologize for that. But look! I just hit the mic. He's spinning on the bush! <laughs> But I thought these little little fountain things were cool. They'd be cool if they spit into a swimming pool or onto your bush, if that's what you would want. But <laughs> there you go. There's the frog. Another one of my favorite features in this pack. Let's go ahead and hop, hop back in and see what else that we get. We also get, doo -doo -doo. oh, the brand new fence. Okay. So yeah, we get this cute little fence gate, right? But it comes in different colors. So I was really excited that we get that option as well. And again, if you just like the basic white, that is an option. Or if you like just the basic brown, that's an option. But you better believe at my house that we have in the game, it's like bright yellow. <laughs> I don't think our neighbors are going to like us very much. The frog is too cute. I need a thousand. That frog is really awesome. So yeah, but then we get the fence gate. And then if you click over here and you go into this little fence. <laughs> We get a colored fence now, guys. Check this out. Okay, clicking on the fence. I'm never in build mode, so this is really bad. Look! Is this just so cool? <laughs> we get a picket fence, but you can have it in all sorts of different colors. How cool would that be around your house to have a fence with all these different bright colors? I can't wait to use that picket fence in my game. <laughs> Summer, Summer Falls. I really wanted that house that you built the other day. <laughs> okay, so that is going to do it for build mode. So we're going to go ahead and hop back into live mode. So yeah, it's the, the lot deleted when I came here, but you get more stuff than this. But let's go ahead and head back home and we're going to have a little bit of a party in our house. Uh, let's go ahead and travel by ourselves. I hope no one came. I want that purple fence. Heck yeah, says Kara Plum Bob. Kara, did you submit a sim a few days ago? Okay, so on Twitter a few days ago, I put out a call for sims. I was like, hey guys, I need some sims for a tiny little project I'm working on. This is the project. I wanted to have your guys, uh, your guys' sims come over to my house. I need to unlock the doors and let everybody out. So basically what I had to do was unlock. <laughs> when I put the slides in the backyard, my sims were like, water slides! And they kept running outside and playing with the slides. I'm like, not yet. We have to wait until everybody's here. <laughs> we have to wait for the live stream. Okay, uh, you guys, let's just let the leave school early. Yeah, you can skip school to play on a water slide. I mean, right? <laughs> Okay, so we are here in the backyard just to show you guys a few things. These are the wind chimes, and they don't jingle all the time, which I really like because that would drive me absolutely nuts. But from time to time, they'll just kind of blow. Um, you can change the pitch so it goes from super high pitch. Do you see how the rods just shrunk down? Or you can do medium pitch. See how they got longer? Oh, they're moving. Oh, I have the volume turned down. Shoot, but they're like really calming when you hear them in the backyard. Or you can do like a low pitch. So every time you change the pitch, the rods change. I don't know. <laughs> you did submit yours on time. Awesome, Kit. So here's the table I was telling you about that I just placed outside in the backyard. I really liked how the citronella candle kind of does that smoky thing, like how they do in real life. Whenever I see citronella candles, I always think of camping. I don't know why, but I just think of camping. <laughs> You held them hostage for us. <laughs> I did. I didn't want them to have fun without you guys being here. <laughs> so I locked them in the house. So we're going to go ahead and have him st see how he immediately went for the water slide. Come over here, dude. I want you to mix a drink. So we're going to go ahead, have him mix lemonade, have him mix the citrus swig. And then for the final drink, we're going to do mixed iced tea. So what I think is really cool 
is that he will mix the drink first and then like put it down and then if you're like oh shoot i meant to do iced tea don't worry look he just picks it back up and he i'm pointing like a dork <laughs> but they'll just switch out uh the drinks if you're like oh shoot i wanted lemonade instead of iced tea don't worry <laughs> They'll switch it out. <laughs> so uh, I don't think they get a moodlet. Oh, I don't think they get a moodlet from drinking up. I don't know. I didn't get that far. Citronella is bug repellent camping miracle. I know, right? <laughs> He's like, this is the best drink I've ever made. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at what else. Oh, the speakers. Wow, I put that really low. <laughs> it's going to be like right behind their head. So let's have them just listen to backyard music. Um, no. Actually, you're a really great victim. Let's turn this off. He's standing close enough to the bird feeder, so let's have him stop drinking that. Push pause. One in seven chance that you will be attacked by bird feeders. The bird feeders is a new thing that is in the game, so let's go ahead, have him add bird seed. I gave them enough money. Yeah, I did. I uh, just cheated in like a ton of money because I wanted to make sure they had money for the bird seeders. Bird seeders. Bird feeders. Okay, you ready? Let's see if he gets attacked on the first time. Nope, he's safe. <gasps> that bird came down. I'm like, <gasps> he's safe so far. I hope he didn't do any of the bird feeders while I was off building other things because they get this moodlet from it. It's like angry bird. No, he's safe so far. Are you guys watching like this? <laughs> He got attacked! I'm so sorry! And I love that they freak out and like swat their arms and they drop the bug, or the bug food, the bird food, the, yeah, the bird food box. Bird seed box, yeah. Sorry, dude, I feel kind of bad. I set you up for that. So, <laughs> he got the mood lit. Angry birds from bird attack. Ah, those green birds have bow feeling is so angry. <laughs> I feel so sorry that I set him up for that, but uh, yeah. Basically, I locked them all in the house so they wouldn't be doing any of this fun stuff without you guys. And the minute I unlock it, I let him out to be attacked by birds. Abort! Abort! <laughs> I know. Yeah. Sorry, dude. I totally set you up for that. So, uh, here's the butterfly in the birdhouse. Look at this cool table. Let's have him come over here. Mix drink. Citrus swig. Let's have her have a seat. Talk over here. Please. A little quickly. <laughs> I, uh, okay, they're hungry. Oh, this makes me really nervous. Okay, let's have her, no, the house is unlocked. They go inside and make themselves some granola. Um, but yeah, there you go. You can fit six sims around this table. I thought that was really cool. And the yellow fence I showed you guys, there's, which water slide do you guys want to see first? Do you guys want to see the shark or do you guys want to see the bright yellow one on the side? Let me know in chat. Just say shark or say yellow. I don't know. How would you say that? Oh, Leanne has acquired the cooking skills. So help me. Please do not burn the house down. Here's the little frog. Look at how cute he is. Oh, I should have set him over in front of the water slide. So you can get the water slide. Shark, shark. Okay, shark goes first. Shark, shark. <laughs> I live near the ocean, so it's kind of funny that I'm saying that. Okay, shark, shark. Everyone's shrieking shark. Okay. I want to show you guys from the teeth side. So we're going to have Leanne stop listening to that cool new radio that we get. Uh, you get the option of watching the people. Oh, that had to hurt. Did you see that? Or we can just do a better. Let's have her do a regular slide. And then we're going to have Bo come over here. Let's have him watch. No, I don't want him to watch. I want him to do a trick slide. Excuse me, trick slide. And then we're going to have Ada slide trick slide with Xander let's get the whole family over here on this slide <laughs> look at how cool I love how the water just shoots out of the teeth can you imagine how fun that would be sliding through that <laughs> she just did a flip okay so another neat thing is too is um the I think it oh I wrote it down but I don't have it nearby me so for adults, this improves. Ooh, that was a cool one. Did you see the spin? He took a tumble. Yeah, they did. Um, okay, so if there's a bunch of Sims in line and there's someone going down the water slide and someone like 
I don't think people say biff it anymore. If they like take a really bad fall, the Sims and Lionel go, oh, <laughs> like that looked really painful. Yes, like you guys are doing a chat. Ouch, ouch. Yeah, basically the same thing. And um, for adults, this improves their athletic skill. For kids, I want to say motor, but I forgot. I wrote it down. And of course, I'm a dork and I don't have it near me. Prince says you're done. <laughs>